<clears throat> Hallelujah. God bless. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. The Bible says, faith without works is dead. Hallelujah. That's what the book of James says. And when you preach to encourage Christians to do good works, when you preach to encourage Christians to be a witness for Jesus, when you preach to encourage Christians to live holy, you have these people, they come and they say, oh, brother, you're preaching works, you're preaching works, faith alone, faith alone. And they say this to justify their unfruitful Christian life. Hallelujah. That's why they do that. And I believe that these people have dead faith. No real Christian would ever come against good works for the kingdom of God. Hallelujah. The Bible says faith without works is dead. The Bible says we are created in Christ Jesus for good works, that we should walk in them. Hallelujah. So when you preach to encourage Christians to do work for Jesus, and people come and they say, oh, brother, faith alone, you're preaching works, you're preaching works, that right there tells me they're not right with Jesus. Immediately. Hallelujah. Immediately, I, I know that. They're not right with Jesus. Jesus said in Luke chapter 10, he said, the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. Pray to the Lord of the harvest that he would send workers into the harvest. Hallelujah. So when I read that scripture, that tells me Jesus wants workers for the harvest. There's help wanted for the kingdom of God. Jesus wants workers for the harvest. Jesus wants laborers for the harvest. That means he wants people that have real faith, that's going to witness his word, that's going to warn sinners to repent, that's going to do good works for the kingdom. Hallelujah. But if you preach to encourage good works, people will come and say, oh, brother, you're preaching works. Faith alone, faith alone. And when they do that, immediately, I know they're not right with God. Hallelujah. The Bible says that God created good works for us to do. Hallelujah. Faith without works is dead. Faith without works is like a broken down car that's stuck in your driveway and it's taking up space. Hallelujah. It's not doing what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to drive you around. It's supposed to bring you places. Hallelujah. But it's broken down. It's taken up space. That's how dead faith is. When people say faith alone, faith alone, and they don't have no works, they like a broken down car that's just stuck in the driveway and they're not doing nothing. They're not doing what they're supposed to do. Hallelujah. We are created in Christ Jesus for good works. And we do these good works by faith. Hallelujah. But people are unfruitful. And they live sinful. They live wicked. And they want to justify living an unfruitful Christian life. They just want to say, faith alone, faith alone. And they live worldly. They live wicked. Hallelujah. And that's not going to hold up with Jesus. Hallelujah. Go read the parable of the talents. Jesus said, cast that unprofitable servant into outer darkness where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. Hallelujah. I didn't say that. Jesus said that in scripture. So if you want to say something, you need to go take it up with Jesus. Hallelujah. He's going to be the one that casts the unprofitable servant into outer darkness. You're the one that's saying you believe, but you're unprofitable. You're the one that's saying, I believe, I believe, but you're unprofitable for Jesus. You don't have no works. Nobody knows you're a Christian. 
Some people, their family don't even know they're a Christian, but they're a Christian on YouTube. They're a Christian in the comments section. They're a Christian on Facebook, but nobody else knows they're a Christian. Hallelujah. Because they got dead faith. That's it. They live in sin. They live in sinful. And they're not working for Jesus. But they'll say they believe. They'll say, I believe, I believe. And if you preach to encourage doing good works for the kingdom of God, they will be against it. Hallelujah. We're in the end times. The Bible says evil men and imposters will wax worse and worse. And this is where we are at. Hallelujah. Faith without works is dead. You want to have real faith? Jesus wants workers for the harvest. Hallelujah. Jesus wants workers to work the vineyard. Will you be a worker for Jesus? Hallelujah. That's the question that Jesus is asking. asking. Will you be a worker for Jesus? Or will you just say, faith alone, faith alone. I don't need to do nothing and live worldly, live wicked, practice sin, and just say you believe like the Bible says. They have a form of godliness, but they deny the power. Hallelujah. Will you be a worker for Jesus? Hallelujah. That's what Jesus is asking. Will you be a worker for Jesus? Because the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. Hallelujah. Be blessed. In Jesus' mighty name.